Hello and welcome to Dixie's Storytime World, Three Billy Goats Gruff. This is the story of Three Billy Goats Gruff. You can read it yourself. It's not very tough. Why not have a try if you're brave enough? One thing more. Can you guess what? On every page, there's worm to spot. In the valley by a river lived three happy billy goats. One was small, little Will, with a bell around his throat. One was tall, brother Bill, with a big and shaggy coat. One was huge, rough, tough, gruff. He could turn you into fluff. On the mountain by a bridge lived a nasty troll called Sid. He had eyes big as pies, ears like two big saucepan lids, yellow teeth, wrinkly throat, and his favourite food was goat. In the valley one fine day, there was not much grass around. Time to go, said little Will. Let's climb up to higher ground, cross the bridge to the pass where there's loads of lovely grass. So the three goats trotted off to the bridge up by the pass. I'll go first, said little Will. Look at all that lovely grass. Trip, trap, trip, as he ran. Sid the troll jumped out and sang. Don't want chicken, don't want lamb. Don't want bacon, don't want ham. Don't want beef or veal or pork. Want some goat upon my fork. Little Will sweetly smiled and he gave a little bleat. Don't have me for your tea. I am not much good to eat. But if goat is your prize, why not try some goat surprise? Goat surprise? said the troll. Ooh, that sounds completely yummy. Just you wait, said little Will, and you'll have some in your tummy. My big bro can tell you more about this meal so scrummy. Let me through, if you will. And he crossed onto the hill. Brother Bill came along with his great big shaggy coat. And up and onto the bridge went this brave, strong billy goat. Trip, trap, trip, as he ran. Sid the troll jumped out and sang, Don't want apples, don't want cherries, don't want peaches, don't want berries, don't want plums or figs or prunes, want some goat upon my spoon. Brother Bill calmly stood, and he gave a little bear. Don't have me for your tea. Eating me won't get you far. But to fill your insides, you should try some goat surprise. Goat surprise? said the troll. Ooh, sounds great. In a mo, said Brother Bill, you will have some on your plate. My big brother will be here. All you have to do is wait. Let me through. Let me pass. And he went to eat some grass. Rough, tough, gruff. Soon appeared, and up to the bridge he sped. He was huge, he was fierce, with great horns upon his head. Trip, trap, trip, as he ran. Sid the troll jumped out and sang. Don't want lettuce, don't want beans, don't want cabbage, don't want green, don't want carrots, peas or shallots, want some goat, here in my pot. Rough, tough, gruff just stood still, and he said to Sid the troll, if it's goat that you want, you can put me in your bowl. Pick on someone your own size. Here's my special goat surprise. Goat surprise? cried the troll. Oh, it's come my way at last. Then he saw rough, tough, gruff charging straight towards him fast. Sid fell sick when a kick hit him like a mighty blast. Rough, tough, gruff put Sid in plaster. Then he went to munch some pasture. Those three goats made their home on that green and grassy hill. With a munch, they had their lunch. Rough, tough, gruff and Bill and Will. Sid the troll disappeared. All his friends said he was ill. From then on, you will note, he couldn't stand the taste of goat. The end. I hope you enjoyed this story and I'll see you soon in the next video. Bye for now.